Kids. Hi friends, welcome to my channel, SWTAD Kids. Today, we're going to be doing something that you guys really enjoy. It's been a while since I've last brought you these happy tins, so yay, I got some more. The first one we're going to do is Minnie Mouse. We're going to check really quickly what it comes with. We have a page of stickers. Ooh, a poster. On one side, it's all color, and on the other side, it's done so we can color it ourselves. Ooh, it's so nice. I'm going to start coloring it right away. We have three best friends, Minnie, Daisy, and Clarabelle. And I think it's a very special day for Minnie and her friends. Want to know why? Oh, it's because Mickey invited me to go out tonight, and he bought me these red roses as a gift. Oh, how romantic. Oh, Minnie, how nice. I wish Donald brought me flowers. Meow. And the poster is finished. Since I like how it came out, I'm going to give myself a sticker. What else do we have over here? Let's check out this big one. Ooh, it's a storybook. Another coloring book. Friends, how about we color the first picture here? Look at this big ice cream that Minnie is about to eat. Even the birdies are craving some. Since I like how it came out, I'm going to grade it with this sticker. Let's see, which other picture should we color? Ooh, that was quick. Donald Duck is bringing flowers to Daisy. I'm happy for Daisy, friends. She really wanted Donald to bring her flowers. Since I like how it came out, we're going to put a Daisy sticker on here. And now it's time for the book that we all love. It's the activity book. Ooh, connect the dots. I love it. And it looks like whatever this is, it's going to be super elegant. I think it's one of those bows that Minnie sells in her boutique. But it's super elegant. Totally a JoJo Siwa type bow, friends. It says to help Minnie and her nieces get to the picnic table. Let's see if I don't get lost. Oh, I think I'm going to get there. I'm going to get there. Yay, I made it. Look for the Minnie that's different. Ooh, I already found her. This one was super easy because all of the Minis had bows on their shoes except for this one. Who am I? Uh, oh, it's super easy. It's Kukuloka. We have to see what Minnie is watering in the garden. Ooh, it's a beautiful flower. And now it's time to put away the Minnie stuff because now it's time to do a tin of Doc McStuffins. And I have good news, it's in Spanish. So we're going to be learning some Spanish words today. The markers are the same color. And let's see the stickers. Ooh, I see a lot of Doc McStuffins friends. And ding, 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 it comes with a poster. It's full color on one side, and for us to color on the other. It looks like the doctor has a very important meeting today. That's why Aurora is there. Stuffy, Lammy, and, and Hallie. The thing is that there's a stuffed animal in the hospital who has fur that's all faded. It used to be blue, but now it looks light blue. That's why the doctor called a very important meeting. They're going to go tend to the teddy bear very quickly. Wow, friends, this one was difficult, but we finished it. And I'm going to grade it with a Doc McStuffins sticker. Let's continue. Yay, a storybook. And it has some super nice and colorful illustrations. And we're going to do the activity book. We have to help the characters find their stuff. The glasses belong to Hallie. The robe is the doctor's, of course. Stuffy down here lost his collar. Lammy with her bow. And this belongs to Aurora. Can we unscramble the names of the characters? This one is Lammy. Here we have Stuffy, in Spanish, Felpita. Here we have Chili, in Spanish, Friolin. 
And here we have Aurora. Find the differences! I love it! The first one is this cloud, then this tree. It says there are six. The snowman's mouth, the snowman's toy hat. I don't see the other two, friends. I'm going to need your help here. And the last one we have here is a coloring book. And let's color the very friendly Stuffy. Friends, snow is falling outside, but Stuffy still wants to go outside and play. I'm sure that he wants to make a snowman. All done! And since I like how it came out, I'm going to put another Doc McStuffin sticker on it. Another one! A fire truck! Oh no! Why is the fire truck sad? Maybe it's scared to go with Doc McStuffins. And for this one, I'm going to put a Lammy sticker on it. Friends, we've finished with the Doc McStuffins tin. And we'll continue with the Trolls tin. Oh, this one is different. Let's see what this one comes with. It has a wig so we can dress like the trolls. How fun! Hair ties and even two hair clips. And it comes with this booklet that gives us ideas on how to play with these hair ties at parties. This hairstyle is cute. We have another one. Wow, it gives us so many ideas for different hairstyles. And the best part is that it shows us how to do them step by step. Ooh, we have an activity here. It says to draw hair for these trolls. It's crazy hair day, boys and girls. So let's make this one. We'll make some pigtails for Poppy, but with some nice bows. For the twins, we'll give them both perms. For this one, we'll make something funny. Oh, I remember this one, but I don't remember how the hair looked. Well, we'll make something like this. It needs to be crazy anyway. We'll decorate it here with flowers. We'll put a mohawk on this one. <laughs> and it looks like Branch is grumpy, so we'll just give him his regular hairstyle. This activity was super fun. I liked it. Ooh, a picture we can color. How about we make a hairstyle with different colors? Wow, a super colorful hair salon, just like her hair. Let's put the troll's tin away now. Let's continue with Princess Sophia. And this one is also in Spanish. So let's take out all of the activities at once. Markers, we have stickers here. Ooh, the poster! This one also has one side fully in color, and we have to color the other side ourselves. So we're going to color it immediately. It's a Saturday morning, and Princess Sophia decided to stay in bed a little bit late so she can play with all her friends from the forest. She was super busy during the week, and she couldn't really spend time with her friends in the forest. Very enthusiastically, the animals tell her all of the things that they did during the week. And I'm going to grade it with a Princess Sophia sticker. Let's check out the books. Yay, a Princess Sophia story. I love these storybooks, guys. They're super colorful. We have to find the correct shadows. Ooh, it's connect the dots, and it forms a beautiful Pegasus. Find the picture that's different. Super easy. This one doesn't have her tiara. And let's look at the coloring book. Ooh, yay! It's the fairy godmothers from Sleeping Beauty. What are Flora and Fauna up to? It looks like Meriwether doesn't agree with the other fairies. It's because Meriwether likes to do things her way. Same. <laughs> All done! I'm going to put another Princess Sophia sticker on. Now it's time to put away the Princess Sophia stuff. So we can do the Num Noms tin now. Let's see what we're going to do with the Num Noms. Markers! Look at how nice the stickers are! 
Wow, they're so pretty! And here we have the poster. Oh, we have to color this one on both sides. Friends, I don't want it to get too late for me to upload this video, so we'll leave the poster for another day. And now, let's see what we have. It's a guide with all of the num noms. Awesome! And it has this coloring book. Oh no, it has activities too. Oh, I know which one we're going to do. We're going to make a hamburger. We'll start off with the bun. We'll put a piece of lettuce, a slice of cheese, a little bit of ketchup, the meat, a tomato slice, and pickles. Since it's a num num, it has to have a face. So let's draw a super kawaii face. Eh, not bad. What do you guys think? Let's look for another fun activity. Let's make an ice cream. Let's start by coloring the dish. Then we'll put a scoop of chocolate ice cream. A scoop of strawberry ice cream. A scoop of vanilla. We'll put some whipped cream on top. And sprinkles! And of course, a cherry on top. Which of these is the imposter? Oh, I found it! It's this one because it doesn't have the little hair curl here. It says to look for the pears. This one goes with this one. This one goes with this one. This one goes with this one. And this one goes with this one. Oh no, this one doesn't have a pear! This activity book was fun, but we still have one more to do, so we have to hurry! Ooh, these are recipes! They're pretty much all recipes! Well, the Num Noms tin was fun, but we have to do one more! And that is My Little Pony the Movie! Markers! Friends, I'm also going to leave this one as well, because I have to hurry! I really want to upload this video early for you guys to enjoy! And let's look at the stickers, because they look super nice! We have a storybook. Oh no, it's actually a book to draw in. How interesting. Let's look at the activity book. And we have to look and see which of these paths take Twilight to Spike. Let's start with B. Let's see how it goes. Oh yay, it was B. How lucky. First guess is the best. And here we have to find the correct shadow. This one isn't it, because it doesn't have a hat. This one either. This one does, but this one does too. Oh, but this one doesn't have a bow on the tail. So the correct shadow is this one. Ooh, I like this one. We have to follow the correct path. The heart means we go to the right. The sun means we go down. The cupcake means to go left. The sun goes down. The heart to the right. And we made it. And finally, we're going to color a picture in here. And I already know which one. And I already know which one because my favorite is Rarity. Friends, Rarity looks good even when dressed up as a pirate. And for those that don't know yet, Mr. Hamilton has his own channel. So go check it out and subscribe. <laughs>